snack time. On space station, when it was time for a snack, we would follow Russian tradition and have black bread and honey. This is the galley section in the service module. And the galley table is visible there. And we're opening up a, a bag of Russian bread. There they are, little, little loaves of bread. Here's a can of Russian honey, miot. You open up the can. There's no Velcro on the Russian food, so to hold them down to the table, you use that strap that's visible. However, with the honey, it's kind of sticky, gooey. So what we would do is we would use uh, what we learned in college in our service chemistry class, and we'd put a drop of water on the bottom of the can, and then you would use surface tension force to hold the can of honey down to the table, just like that. Voila. And here we are. The honey drawing out little threads. We put the, the loaves of Russian bread in there. They're little individual loaves, bite size. Scale down to the right size for a Barbie doll. So we would refer to them as our Barbie breads. You can pull out a loaf and, and a tractor beam of honey will draw it back in the can. And you can uh, scarf down your bread and honey. Now here is a bag of tea. Now it's not a tea bag, it's a bag of tea and it's off to the left. And there's a straw that you normally suck the tea out of the bag with. Here we're gonna use our chopsticks to eat tea. So you squeeze a little hot tea out from the bag and it forms a sphere on the end of the straw. And then you can use your surface tension forces again to be your friend and you can just grab a blob of tea with your chopsticks and then you can eat it. Now notice the in the can of honey you have a hemispherical surface profile too. You won't see that in a gravitational setting for something that large in diameter. So here we are eating our tea with chopsticks. Yum yum. There we go. Oops, you spill a drop. It doesn't matter. You just grab it with the chopsticks. And again, service tension force is your friend in weightlessness. Ah. Now here's some peanut butter. And there's nothing better than peanut butter and honey. So look at that. Mix a little peanut butter in with the honey. Oops, we're losing a cracker off there to the right. And then we just mix it in a little bit using the chopsticks. And this is really yummy stuff. It's, it's good on crackers. Oh, yum, yum. And look at that. Kind of looks like a sea creature. And this is an example that in space, you get to play with your food and you can call it science. And now you just dip a cracker in there. And oh, it's really yummy. Well, after you're done with your snack, you have to clean up. And here is what we do for cleaning up. You gotta smash your cans. And it's actually a, sort of a strength exercise. So you smash your can to make them a smaller volume than they normally would be. And then you put them in a, in a wet trash container where, where they won't get all stinky. That's that little rubber bag down off of the, the, the handrail there. You, you smash them as small as you can and then the the bag there is held on with a big rubber band and you just pull it off, stick it in the bag with all the other wet wrappers that are contaminated with food and then you, you stick the neck of the bag underneath the rubber band and uh, away you go. And then we have another waste basket for dry trash and you can wipe up your, clean up your scissors and wipe off the table and leave it clean.